I'm trying to think of a good analogy. So it is the same, uh, you know, although it's in many ways, you know, quite different. It's, uh, you know, kind of maybe maybe the best kind of thought of what the difference would be is, you know, um, you know, Chernobyl would be more like, you know, you, you get in a bicycle accident and you fall off your bike and you have all kinds of abrasions and broken bones in your body because it just, the injury goes everywhere as opposed to a highly trained surgeon uh, taking out your appendix. <laughs> that, that's the difference. Yes, both involve uh, cutting various soft tissues and all the rest, but, uh, but one is obviously preferable over the other. Uh, uh, because one is highly directed in, in where the tissue injury is happening. And so, so radiation therapy is using high technologies, um, particularly given the advances in radiology, the ability to image various parts of the body, and then using the, the property of radiation therapy, which is that with external beam, it actually doesn't deposit its dose right away. It actually has to travel a distance in body before it de deposits its dose. So it's using um, that property of the radiation therapy and then using very uh, computer-based technologies to deliver the radiation to, to create these uh, very conformal uh, areas of radiation dose uh, where it treats the tumor and then even even very highly complexly uh, complex shapes of tumors um, and then quickly falls off so that the normal tissues around uh, around the tumor are are spared and uh, and of course radiation interacts with uh, with cancer cells by uh, damaging the DNA and ultimately causing cancer cell cancer cell death so you're taking advantage um, of that property of the radiation to bring about uh, cancer cure uh, to the site that you're treating. So, so anyways, the the that that to me is more of a like a precision surgeon, <laughs> uh, you know, removing some part of the body um, as compared to a uh, an injury that sort of inadvertently kills and and harms all kinds of tissues, um, which would be more analogous to what Chernobyl caused in patients.